Greetings and welcome to the introduction to astronomy. One of the things that I like to do in each of my introductory astronomy classes is to begin the class with the astronomy picture of the day from the NASA website that is apod.nasa.gov apod. And today's picture for December 31st of 2022, well, it is titled Moon over Makemake. So what do we see here? Well, here we see an artist's rendition of one of the five dwarf planets currently known in our solar system. So we divide up our solar system into different types of objects. We have the major planets, uh, which are the eight planets, Mercury out through Neptune. And then there are other types of objects, such as asteroids and comets, which are much smaller. And then in between are the dwarf planets, a relatively new classification uh, to identify objects that are much larger than, say, the comets or asteroids, but many times smaller and less dominant in their area than the larger planets. So Pluto has now been classified as one of, the, one of these, as well as the former asteroid series, and a couple of objects like Makemake here out in the Kuiper Belt, out beyond Neptune. Now this is, as I said, an example of a dwarf planet, and it is an artist's conception of the drawing because we have never visited Makemake, so we have no idea exactly what it is like. However, we can use our information that we do have to make a very good educated guess as to what things might look like on Makemake should we be able to travel out there at some point in the distant future. So a Makemake, as we see here, actually does have a moon as well that was discovered several years ago back in 2016 by the Hubble Space Telescope searching for faint objects around these distant dwarf planets. So its moon is about one-tenth of its diameter, a moon being only about 100 miles across and Makemake being a little less than maybe a thousand miles across its diameter. And we see them here from behind looking back toward our sun. Now, from this distance, our sun would seem much, much fainter than it does from Earth. Makemake, about 50 times further away from the sun than our Earth. And therefore, the sun would be 2,500 times fainter. So, while it would still be by far the brightest star in the sky, it would not look like the large disk that we are used to seeing from Earth. It would be almost like a very bright star, just a point-like object looking from this very great distance. So perhaps future exploration will be able to tell us a little bit more about what Makemake looks like, although we can get some ideas from the studies of New Horizons and Pluto that gave us an up-close look at one of the dwarf planets and then another object within the Kuiper Belt. So continued studies and perhaps future explorations will teach us more about this distant object. So that was our picture of the day for December 31st of 2022. It was titled Moon over Makemake. We'll be back again tomorrow for the next picture, previewed to be Planet Earth. So we'll see what that is about tomorrow. And until then, have a great day, everyone, and I will see you in class.